enforce the order of law equally and honestly on all citizens. This came in a meeting with Minister of Justice, Councillor Omar Marwan, on Monday. Presidential spokesperson Councillor Ahmed Fahmi said during the meeting, President Sisi was briefed on the measures of activating a law on the Non-Governmental National Alliance for Civil Work and current efforts to develop mechanisms of coordination in order to deepen the concept of volunteering and develop the humanitarian and social values. The spokesperson added that the meeting tackled the developments of the executive situation of establishing the City of Justice in the new administrative capital within the framework of ongoing efforts to achieve integrated development of the judicial system. Foreign Minister Samah Shukri held on Monday a joint press conference with the visiting Dutch counterpart at Heinke Bruin Slot following their meeting in the new administrative capital. The talks tackled several regional developments and means of boosting bilateral relations in various domains. Foreign Minister Samah Shukri held on Monday a joint press conference with visiting Dutch counterpart at Heinke Bruin Slot following their meeting in the new administrative capital. Shukri said that the meeting discussed means of boosting political coordination between the two countries on several regional and international issues of mutual concern. Shukri added that the talks tackled joint cooperation in various domains, including the field of clean energy. On the situation in Gaza, the top diplomat reiterated that the talks focused on opening borders to facilitate the path of humanitarian aid into the Strip. He pointed out that children are dying in Gaza due to shortage of food and medical aid, asserting that the Egyptian Rafah is the only border responsible for aid path to the Strip. Shukri further affirmed the Egyptian and Arab policies seeking an immediate ceasefire in Gaza, which should be implemented before the holy month of Ramadan. For her part, Slot said that Egypt is an important market for investments in the region and stressed keenness on fostering bilateral cooperation in the fields of climate and intelligent methods of agriculture. Slot expressed concern on any military attacks on the Palestinian Rafah in South Gaza and keenness on releasing hostages in the Strip. Foreign Minister Sameh Shukri on Monday asserted that an immediate ceasefire and a truce in the Gaza Strip should be enforced before the month of Ramadan in order to allow a flow of humanitarian aid and relief staff in sufficient amounts. Meeting in Cairo with a senior UN humanitarian and reconstruction coordinator for the Gaza Strip, Segrid Kag, the top diplomat also deplored systematic attempts to derail work by the UNRWA agency in support of the Palestinian refugees. The UN official appreciated the important and pivotal role Egypt has undertaken since the beginning in order to push for a truce, defuse the crisis and to provide and facilitate aid to the Gaza Strip. Upon directives by President Abdel Fattah Sisi, Egyptian Air Forces, in cooperation with the Emirati Air Forces, airdropped tons of humanitarian aids into Gaza in an attempt to ease the suffering of Gazans. This came as Egyptian active efforts continue to reach 